We're here on the Mall, just outside Buckingham Palace, where the Queen's procession has just passed us by, led by King Charles. Pretty emotional, Paddy. How was it for you? Yeah, well, you know, we were reporting, and um, I was helping you, Sam. And, you know, for me, it was a little bit stressful at first because we were trying to get you into a really good spot so that people back at home could see, you know, what was happening and get a feel for things. So, uh, What about the crowd? People had been talking amongst themselves, doing Sudoku, playing with their yeah. pets that they had brought with them, and, and then were, it went silent. They were hanging all across the sort of, any sort of vantage point, but then it's that silence, and I could first hear the, the clipping and clopping of the horses, and it was the Metropolitan and Police. And the big boom yeah, of the like drum. Yeah, that, 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 that drum, and then of course the music. And you know, when you're here uh, on the Mall with all of the, uh, you know, Buckingham Palace down there and all of the flags and the trees the and everything. The ornate gates. Yeah, yeah, and as soon as she started to come past and I could see the crown uh, on, oh, on top there, yes. I could see the crown coming. So I was saying to you, here she comes. I actually said those words, here she comes, mm -hmm. um, here she comes. I remember that. And that was when I got hit by a wave of emotion. You know, yeah. I just, yeah, I got hit by a wave of emotion that the Queen was going. And I think, you know, it was, it, to be honest, I actually thought of my own grandparents, and I don't know why I hadn't thought of this before. You know, my grandfathers, both both my grandfathers fought for the Queen, uh, and I just haven't really, that hadn't really passed my mind, and, and I was just hit by a wave of emotion for a Aww. moment there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, but it then I was also the happy that you got your piece, you, that you got your piece of camera away as well, so that we, gave me another we, bit of emotion. We got yeah. the shot, Yeah. But it, but it was emotional. It was just, it was almost like the air completely changed from the minute that the crowd could see her where we were standing right up until she had passed us by mm. and then people went about their day again. Yeah. It was extraordinary. Yeah. What, and, a, what and, a moment to see and witness and to be able to bear witness uh, for our viewers back in New Zealand. And a couple of great Kiwis came up to us afterwards and a wonderful couple. Um, people will see them on television, but they turned out to both be deaf, didn't they, Sam? Yes, yes. Um, from the deaf community, yeah. uh, they live in Nelson. He really wanted to do an interview and he was finding it really hard, And but he really wanted yeah. to say something. and To share um, how he felt in the yeah, moment. And, and I thought you were super patient, and for me that's the moment um, of the day, um, seeing you interview that deaf couple. And oh my gosh, um, you've got to get ready uh, for six o'clock. Yeah. Um, yeah. I've got to get going to the High Commission. So that was behind the scenes of the procession. Yeah, the procession here at Buckingham Palace in London.